Hello and welcome to Santa Margarita Elementary School. Um, this is our school garden. It is quite large. There are a total of 18 beds that we plant in. Um, we also have these lovely tables. This is where we teach classes. Um, also during some parts of the year we put an easy up structure over the tables to create some shade. These are our garden agreements. Um, students helped make this sign and paint it and decorate it and helped come up with what types of agreements we want um, for practices in our garden. So this first row of beds, we're basically letting to go to seed the whole row. Right here, this first bed, we have radishes. So all these radishes bolted up and started flowering. And I'm letting the pods go to seed so we can harvest them. I'm doing the same thing for this bed over here with peas. So once all the pods dry up, I will use those um, pea pods. This is some celery that's um, flourishing. It's doing really good right now. And over here we have some lettuces, kales, and general green things. And here we have a big blackberry bush. The kids really like eating all of the yummy blackberries that come. And we can see that the pollinators and the bees are really, really loving this right now during the springtime. And in the back side of the garden, we have all of this calendula. And this calendula has produced thousands and thousands of flowers this year. And I just keep picking them and they keep coming back up. As well as this nectarine tree. This nectarine tree is producing many, many fruits. You can see how densely packed these branches are with fruits. So I'm very excited um, because I'm just a month or so, I think a lot of these are going to be ready to eat and ready to enjoy for the kids. And last but not least, we have this shady reading corner. This is one of my favorite places in the garden because there's just a couple benches and students can come here to have quiet reading time or just have an escape when they need some time by themselves.